This is the race to the finish, the rival's room. What's good, Escape Academy? You are here it's kind of a long one because you have several different areas you have to get to. We're going to start by grabbing all the necessary gears. Let's see if they make it past the ballista. Try to keep up. You can just follow me and see where I place the gears. I apologize, I do place one incorrectly and then remove it. I mistakenly thought that I was missing a gear, but I was not. Just put it in the wrong spot. So we go large gear small gear and then medium gear at the end give that handle a turn All right, onto the second phase. This is where things kick into now here you need to look at that wall with the letters and names and you want to look and see which names appear the same to both people which are legible from both sides of the wall. It's going to be Wyatt, Timmy, and Max. Impressive speed puzzling from the red track. No, I thought I had it. This could tip the scales of the whole competition. <sighs> So the first thing you can do is come on over and grab the weights from the racks. Because you're going to need them all. Then you can place them on the scale here to see which one is heavier than which. And you can do all of them or you can just do a few and then guess. But I'm going to show you the answers. Once you've done enough of those or if you just want to do what I do here, just go ahead and start adjusting the various weights on this board here so that you'll know what you're dealing with. So that final ranking there was what you want to do. There's the numbers again and you'll move on. Get your weights off the scale there if you haven't done it. One last look at what the numbers are. So now we can go and try to turn the power on. So when you place a weight that say weighs one kilogram, if you put it in the times two, it's two kilograms. So what you're doing here is there's multipliers, one, two, and three on each, on each leverage board here. So if you put the one kilogram weight on the times three multiplier, it's worth three kilograms. And you have to get it to add up to those numbers at the end of the leverage board. Or you could just put them where I put them and that'll accomplish the same thing. Their slip. I'd be attacking those puzzles harder. But both red and blue are putting up a decent fight. Could go either way. Now here you want to you're gonna have to hit in order the buttons with those symbols. And you have to rotate the walls to get them so that you're able to walk up and press the button. You have to do it in under ten moves. So if you do what I do here, that will accomplish that. I don't know if there is a slightly better way to do it with fewer moves. But it doesn't matter. You can still grade out at an A+, plus if you do it this way. 
Each button there moves two walls at a time, but different ones. So I set up the first round with two moves, and I got three symbols out of the way. You can spin them left or right, obviously. You can choose which two to rotate at one time. And I know I've got a few spins left, so I go get those two. And now I can just get to the last one, the heart. And again, you could just follow what I did and hit exactly those buttons in exactly that sequence, and you'll be on your way. Stretch of this competition now. Oh, my favorite puzzle of all, the double-sided safe. This one here up top, just follow along with what I do, alternating tiles to create that pattern that'll get us started with a cabinet key you see there it's telling us G E A E D we're gonna ring the bells in that order G E A E D You'll escape when pigs fly is a little message there. We also get the bronze medal. So I'll slap the medal onto that safe. And then here at this little wheel puzzle, we're going to give a pig wings. And that gets us in to see up, right, up, left, down. take these coins over here you need to get them to add up to the numbers across and down or you could just follow me here and put the coins where I place them and that will accomplish that and open the door Okay, we got a deck of cards there, king of hearts, queen of diamonds, seven of spades, and three of clubs. We're going to go over to the clock puzzle, and we're going to move those corresponding suits on the hands to the proper position on the clock. So we hit the heart till it gets to the king, the diamond till it gets to the queen, seven of spades and three of clubs take our silver medal and we also got the word bane so let's go up here and enter bane get our marbles and you can tap the buttons here in the order that I do to finish this puzzle off green green orange green 
orange orange got our gold medal and we're about to grab our trophy <laughs> 